Welcome back to Infigyan, my dear friends. Today in this video, we are going to take up another challenging question from radical equations. Given equation is x plus 12 over x plus 1 over 1 over x plus 12 over x square plus 3 equal to x. x belongs to real number and x cannot be equal to 0 as we have x in the denominators also. So let's get started by considering multiplication of x in numerator and denominator. So we'll multiply here also with x. Now let's multiply this x with the bracket. So x times x, x is square. x times 12 over x, 12. x times 1, x divided by the square root of. I will consider this x into the square root. So I will be writing x square inside and then 1 over x plus 12 over x square plus 3. Right hand side is x. Now I will multiply this x square with the bracket terms. So x square plus x plus 12. This is numerator. Denominator is x square times 1 over x, so x. x square times 12 over x square, so 12. And x square times 3, then 3x three square. Right hand side is x. Now I will cross multiply. So I will write x square plus x plus 12 equal to x times square root x plus 12 plus 3x square or 3x square plus x plus 12. Now important point is denominator cannot be 0. So let me write 3x square plus x plus 12. This cannot be equal to 0. Let's check the roots. If I will only check the discriminant b square, so 1 square minus 4 times a times c. So it is 1 minus 4 times 3 is 12. 12 times 12 is 144. So this value is somewhere negative. Negative 143. It is negative. So complex solution will generate. There is no constraint of denominator 0 for real values. So we can multiply. Now I will use substitution. Let me write our equation. x square plus x plus 12. And then I will be writing x times the square root 3x square plus x plus 12. Now I will use substitution. I will write x square plus x plus 12 suppose equal to a. So this is square root or radicand I will split. So let me write once x square plus x plus 12 equal to x times square root 2x square. Now I will be writing x square plus x plus 12. Now I will put this substitution to our equation. Substitution is x square plus x plus 12 equal to a. So here we will be putting a and here we will be putting a. a equal to x square root 2x square plus a. Take squaring both sides. So I will be writing a square equal to x square in bracket 2x square plus a. Now I will multiply RHS a square equal to 2x power 4 plus ax square. Take all the term to LHS and make one quadratic equation in A. So A square minus AX square minus 2X power 4 equal to 0. Now I will find out A using quadratic formula. So let us apply quadratic formula. First I will write this equation A square minus AX square minus 2x power 4. 
a square minus a x square minus 2 x power 4 and our substitution is x square plus x plus 12 equal to a. Let us apply quadratic formula a equal to minus b. So, minus of minus x square. So, x square plus minus under the root b square. So, minus x square x power 4 minus 4 a c. So, a is 1 c is minus 2 x power 4. So, minus times minus plus 4 times 2 is 8 x power 4 divided by 2 a. So, 2. Now I will write x square plus minus. This is square root 9x power 4 divided by 2. Now I will take a square root of 9x power 4. It will be 3 times x square divided by 2. So I can write with plus sign 4x square by 2. So 2x square with minus sign minus 2x square by 2, so minus x square. Now this is equal to a and a is our substitution x square plus x plus 12. So let us write here a and I will be writing two equations a equal to 2x square and second equation I will write a equal to minus x square. So from first equation I can put the value of substitution x square plus x plus 12 equal to 2x square. And here I can write x square plus x plus 12 equal to minus x square. Let's solve this first quadratic equation. It will be 2x square. Take all the term to RHS first. So I will write 2x square minus x square. So let me write directly equation. It would be x square minus x minus 12 equal to 0. And second equation I will take all the term to LHS. So it will become 2x square plus x plus 12 equal to 0. Now if I will factorize directly or we can apply quadratic formula also. So let me consider both the equations here. Let me write here. So I will be writing x square minus x minus 12 equal to 0 and second equation was 2x square plus x plus 12 equal to 0. Let's consider first equation. I will use Quadratic formula itself x is equal to minus b so minus of minus 1 plus 1 plus minus under the root b square so 1 minus 4 a c so plus 48 divided by 2 a so 2 1 plus minus is square root 49 divided by 2 square root 49 we will write 7 divided by 2 with plus sign I can write 8 over 2. With minus sign I will write minus 6 over 2. So our answer for x values 4 and negative 3. We will check whether both are correct or not. Now let us consider the second quadratic equation. First one is done. Now I will only check the discriminant whether it is creating complex solutions or not. So discriminant should be positive for real values. So I will write b square. b is 1. So 1 square minus 4 times a times c. As we already discussed this, 1 minus 4 times 2, 8, 12, 8 is 96. So I will write here minus 95. So this value is negative. Complex solution will generate and we are looking for only real solutions. So this solution we will reject. So which one is accepted? It is 4 and negative 3. 
let's check which solution we will accept and which we will reject let me write here x is equal to 4 lhs i will write 4 plus 12 over 4 plus 1 divided by square root 1 over 4 plus 12 over 4 square means 16 plus 3 we have to check whether it is coming out 4 or not because right hand side is x means 4 okay so 12 over 4 is 3 so i will be having numerator 4 plus 3 plus 1 and denominator it is 1 over 4 plus 12 over 16 so we can write it is 4 over 16 plus 12 over 16 plus 3 now 12 plus 4 16 over 16 1 3 plus 1 4 a square root 4 so let me write here 4 plus 3 plus 1 better is to write 8 here and denominator will be 1 plus 3 8 over square root 4 8 over 2 value is 4 and it is our x so true this value is correct now let us consider the second value x is equal to negative 3 so i will be writing negative 3 plus 12 over negative 3 plus 1 lhs divided by square root of 1 over negative 3 plus 12 over 9 plus 3 now this is minus 3 minus 4 plus 1 over square root of this is 1 over negative 3 can we write minus 3 over 9 plus 12 over 9 plus 3 so i will write here minus 3 minus 4 minus 7 plus 1 minus 6 divided by the square root minus 3 plus 12 so 9 over 9 1 1 plus 3 so it is generating minus 6 over square root 4 and this is nothing but minus 6 over 2 so value is coming out negative 3 that means this value is also true so both solutions we will accept i hope this video will be meaningful to you do not forget to like share and subscribe friends bye bye till next video good luck and take care of yourself bye bye